Hi guys, my name is Michael Mordens and today is April 16th, uh, 2021 and this is another update on the situation in Ukraine and the situation with the travel to Ukraine and the restrictions that are currently in place. Uh, basically, let's start from the beginning. Uh, as you know, uh, they require the PCR COVID test, the negative PCR COVID test uh, in order for you to enter Ukraine, but what's important to keep in mind is that um, you have to have this test uh, at the moment when you board your plane out of the US uh, if you are flying from the United States uh, because the airline company will require you to show uh, this test at the moment when you board your plane. Uh, so not only you have to show it to the border officer or the passport control officer when you arrive in Ukraine, but also you need to show it to the uh, airline staff uh, when you check in for your flight. Uh, another very important point, uh, it's vital that this has to be a PCR test and it actually has to say on the test, uh, on the hard copy that you print out, uh, it has to say PCR. Uh, there are several different types of uh, testing for the COVID, like uh, rapid test or whatever. It has to be the PCR test that was conducted no longer than 72 hours uh, before the moment you cross the Ukrainian border. Uh, so, as long as you have this test and your insurance policy, uh, the special insurance policy for the COVID that you can purchase on visitukraine.today, uh, you will have no problem entering Ukraine. Uh, concerning the situation in Kharkiv, uh, as of uh, last Sunday, uh, all the indoor dining uh, is now prohibited in Kharkiv. So uh, most uh, places, most cafes and restaurants still work, but they, you can only eat outside. And I will show you a couple of places so you, you get an idea of what's it like. Uh, to eat outside, to eat outdoors, uh, because it's getting warmer. Uh, it actually it was warmer uh, over the weekend, but now it became a little bit cooler, but it will be getting warmer and warmer because we are uh, coming towards the spring and summer. Uh, it's not such a big deal, so I'll show you what's it like to eat outdoors in, uh, in Kharkiv. It's really not that bad. Uh, in terms of other things that are not available, the gyms are not open. At the moment, uh, the malls are closed as well. So, uh, walking as much as you want uh, is there, beautiful parks. Uh, and of course, the main reason why our clients come to Kharkov to meet the ladies. Uh, we are working, everything is fine. The city is alive. Of course, there are certain restrictions, but uh, I guess after a year since this pandemic began, people learned how to cope with them. Uh, so I will go, uh, I will walk around the couple of blocks and show you around. Hope you are going to enjoy it.